hello sweet team welcome back to my channel this is sweet ajele and i am back with another recipe we're making peppered gizzards today after someone shared a picture of this in my group it's all about sweetie team teens it became highly requested that i make it so here you have it let's get started in a pot add in your nicely cleaned and parboiled gizzards to that add some water and we're going to season it with some all-purpose seasoning to taste and also some kiliwili seasoning i'll stir everything together and i'll go ahead and add in some onions for the flavor i always like to add some chili pepper when i'm steaming my gizzards and the kiliwili seasoning has that so perfect meanwhile i'll get started in cooking our rice so to a pot i've added in some coconut oil to that some chopped onions and we're going to fry this until it is nice and golden brown yes i'm making it the way my grandma makes it she loves to caramelize her onions just like this you see some of them are beginning to brown and that is when you add in your nicely washed rice we're also adding a little sprinkle of turmeric and some salt to taste in our sweet team member yeah dom yamiche's photo her rice was on the yellow side so we're gonna use turmeric to give us that same effect we'll then stir everything together until it is well combined and then we'll stir fry this just until it begins to stick to the bottom of our pot an indication that it is ready to take in my water i'll add the water stir beautifully and you want to add the water according to how you like your rice i like it single grained and i love jasmine rice which doesn't like too much water so i add it just above the level of my rice which is perfect like this stir everything taste for salt adjust if needed and then we'll cover it up and bring it to a boil once it boils we'll lower the heat and allow it do its thing until our rice is ready back to check on our gizzards which was cooking on medium low heat and it has absorbed all of the sauce around it so i just drizzled a bit of coconut oil over it and we're just going to shallow fry this because i want the gizzards to take in the delicious flavor of our coconut oil and then we'll set it aside in this cup right here i'm going to add in some green bell peppers to that i'll add some onion and habanero pepper now the habanero pepper is to your taste the one that i'm using is super hot so i'm only using half of it when making peppered gizzards it needs to be nice and spicy but at the end of the day please add the amount of pepper to your taste and using my hand or immersion blender we're going to blend it to our preferred smoothness i don't want it to be completely smooth and it is not a lot for me to put in my regular blender that is why i'm using this one but you can use your regular blender once it's nicely blended Pour it in a pan and allow all the water to cook out of it just like this. And then we're going to go ahead and add in our oil. And we do it this way because if you add oil to begin with, your countertop will be a mess with splatter because it will be splashing all over the place. But if you cook it first without any oil, it cooks down beautifully. Then once you add your oil, you stir, just allow it fry on medium heat for about five minutes and then we'll come back and check on it add in some all-purpose seasoning to taste you may add salt or any other seasoning of your choice stir everything together add in your gizzards and allow everything to simmer on low heat for an additional five minutes yes y'all now 
cook the gizzards to your preferred tenderness. I love it nice and tender. Five minutes later, I'll add in some carrots, stir everything together, continue cooking for just another minute, and then we'll go ahead and add in some green bell peppers and some onions, stir, and then garnish with some spring onions. I peppered gizzards are ready oh my goodness this was so flavorful so delicious even if you do not like gizzards i promise you're gonna love 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 this one now that everything is ready let's go check on our rice and oh my goodness look at this rice the fragrance the flavor everything is on point now all that is left is for us to serve and enjoy oh 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 everybody is invited to enjoy this deliciousness with me thank you all so so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video and are inspired to try the recipe if you do tag me on instagram so i can share it on my story until i see you in the next one stay safe keep loving each other and remember that the love of god and family is life's greatest blessing and guys ke onamini uchemi suite mahabutsu bye y'all continental food madam international food captain who show you how to make pizza Sushi and pastries, all this and more. Sweet Ajay.